Hello! Here's a cheery little game that we're going to play. This is Plantera. Uh, I was given this key for free by the game's developers, which was very nice of them. So I thought I'd take a look at it. I'm um, never very sure whether this is going to be my type of game. Anyway, here we go. Start a brand new game. Uh, clicky butterflies. Well, that wasn't too difficult. See, ah, uh, we place some carrots in the ground, and presumably, I wait for the little man to grow them. Or no, they grow on their own. Right. Oh, what's this? Aha! Uh, a mole, I guess. Oh, butterflies aren't. Oh, I see. Maybe they have to reach maturity. Ah, uh, now the carrots are ready. Oh, I could put them too. Right. Click, click, click. Oh, that butterfly's ready. And that's how I get coins, is it? Guess I could buy more carrots. I uh, see. Right, several categories. Oops. <coughs> oh, it's level two. Now I can grow something else. Oh, a bush. Oh, I see. Blueberries, is it? Ah, oh, bastard mole. Well, at least I get money for getting rid of him. So, we'll earn some money from our carrots. And keep going, I guess. I suppose the thing to do is to add extra crops. And, oh, that's a bird. Yeah, that's a bad bird. Let's get him away. Hmm. Okay, he just harvests carrots on his own. Got a bird again. Mole again. I very much get the impression that uh, I'm going to be doing a lot of clicking here. Uh -huh. hmm. Now I'll tell you what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip ahead in the game a little bit and uh, let you know how I've got on. Well, as you can see now, I've got a couple of trees, a couple of bushes, lots of crops. Uh, oh, rabbit, they're bad. I've bought a scarecrow as well. Um, however, as you can see, the scarecrow only really works if the crow comes down in that area, so it's not been the greatest investment. Oh, that rabbit, go away. And yeah, I'm basically clicking quite a lot. Oh, fox. Um, I've got an animal of some sort, a chicken, uh, and that fox will come and eat him if he can. So there's a whole bunch of uh, pests who will try and prevent you from farming and uh, you're trying to earn money to upgrade stuff. Yeah, so there's a new tree. It, it is a lot of clicking, uh, but I quite like it. In I enjoy games where you, you know, it's all, as I, as I said in an earlier review, I, I enjoy games that are sort of one-handed games. That sounds a bit perverse, but um, it's it's simply that it's a game where I don't have to pay a huge amount of attention and I'm not fully engaged in all of the keyboard and stuff. I like games that I can just play with a mouse. Um, even games like um, Supreme Commander, which is you know, a complex RTS, uh, you can pretty much play it entirely with a mouse. So it's, it's a game I can kind of relax whilst playing, even if it is deep. Uh, this is a much more shallow game. But that's not a bad thing. I'm quite enjoying it, actually. Now I'm going to skip ahead a bit and uh, go further on in the game. Okay, here we are later on again. Um, you know, I haven't bought a lot of crops uh, because I discovered the pumpkins are worth six. And uh, yeah, it turns out you can delete existing crops. Um, every time you expand your landscape, uh, you get an extra little man to help you, which is nice. Uh, but I haven't really uh, expanded a huge amount. Uh, so, eh. Uh, it is a lot of clicking though. And um, I, I barely have time to go and sort of look through all the other things to decide what I'm going to grow. Uh, this is more like uh, Farmville than Stardew Valley for instance. But yes, I'm quite enjoying it. Um, one of the things that the game will do is when you quit out of the game, 
uh, when you come back in, it's earned some money for you whilst you're away. I like games that uh, use a sort of real-time approach like that. Back in the old Palm Pilot, I used to play a game called uh, Fish Tycoon, and there's another one called, I think it was called Plant Tycoon, by the same people. Uh, developer was Last Day of Work, I believe. And um, those were games where, yes, your fish grow in real time, your plants grow in real time. And uh, when you're away and not playing the... Oh, hello. Oh, yes, he's... I don't know who he is. I think I'm supposed to recognise him from a different game, but uh, he makes me coins. Um, but, yeah, so I, I like a game that does something while you're away. Um, I remember somebody complaining once that it's effectively a game that rewards you for not playing. But it's not quite true. And um, you don't earn very much whilst you're away. But it's it's nice to come back in and go, ooh, little bonus for me. Uh, but what's putting me off right now is the sheer amount of clicking I've got to do. And um, I pretty much discovered that if I just go backwards and forwards on the arrow keys to scroll across, just clicking constantly like this, then uh, I'll, I'll get a lot of uh, harvesting done. It's, it's perhaps the most efficient use of my time. So, hmm. Uh, what I'm trying to save up for is the second icon here, uh, costing 5,000, doubles your coin income. Well, that seems like an obvious thing to do. So, uh, to finish off this game, I'm going to skip ahead to the point where I've actually got that, and we'll see how I'm doing. Here we go, I've got my 5,000, and I've just got time to actually go and click on things. Doubles current coin production, that's what we want. Okay, does it really? Oh yes, it does. Oh, now pumpkins are worth 12. So yeah, that seems like the obvious thing to grab. Um, so, anyway. This is Plantera. It costs one ninety nine on Steam, which I think is very reasonable. It's not going to be a game I'm going to play a lot, but it is a game I'm going to keep coming back to. Uh, I did play Farmville for a bit. And my goodness me, when Stardew Valley came out, gosh, I played that heavily. Uh, this doesn't have the same level of appeal. It's a lot simpler and it's a bit of a clicker. Um, I, I think perhaps it's been ported from the tablet or phone or whatever. Um, and it's maybe better suited there. I don't know. Um, this is a fun, nice little game that I'm going to pick up and play for five minutes from time to time. And uh, as a game like that, this is a good one. 